Today we are covering ALICE training, or what to do in the event of an armed intruder. ALICE stands for Alert, Lockdown, Inform, Counter, and Evacuate. ALICE is a set of proactive strategies to ensure safety. There is no particular sequence for these concepts. They will vary from situation to situation. Alert. When you first become aware of a threat, alert is overcoming denial, recognizing the signs of danger and receiving notifications about the danger from others. Alert should be accepted, taken seriously, and should help you make decisions based on your circumstances. Lockdown. If evacuation is not a safe option, classrooms will go into lockdown. Lockdown is more than locking a door. During a lockdown, you will also use furniture and other large items in the room to barricade the entrance. In the event of a lockdown, place the items against the doorway to interfere with an intruder. The goal of a lockdown is to put a physical barrier between you and an intruder. Also, be sure to silence your mobile devices and be ready to switch to other responses if necessary. Inform. Communicate real-time information on an intruder's location. Use clear and direct language using any communication means possible. Counter. During a counter, objects are thrown at the intruder to physically overwhelm them. Counter is to be used as a last resort. During counter, you would actively engage the intruder with the goal of confusing or stopping them by throwing and striking with handheld objects in the classroom. An ambush tactic as the intruder enters the room would be most effective. Remember to make noise and move. Evacuate. Use evacuate if, during an active event, you determine the threat is far enough away from you that you can safely leave. Exit through the safest path with the goal of moving away from the event. If necessary, break through windows by striking a top corner. Move to a rallying point. If you contact law enforcement while evacuating, remember to keep your hands visible and to follow their instructions. If you evacuate, remember to clear the roadway as much as possible for first responders and do not try to enter at another campus. Once lockdown is activated at one campus, all campuses go into lockdown. Do not return to your campus after evacuating and remember to contact the police department so they can record your name and that you are safe. What can you do every day to help prevent an armed intruder? Simple things like never propping a door open, never opening a secured door for anyone, and reporting any suspicious items, behaviors, or comments to the law enforcement or school staff. 